So let's talk about some of the similarities and differences among the kayak different types. If you come over here, you have a bunch of kayaks laid out on the lawn. You see the, this blue one, this is a creek boat designed for going over steep drops. The next one in is what we call a river runner, designed to have some speed along the river. And the final one here in the whitewater line is our playboat. Way over here is our sea kayak, or our touring boat. First of all, you can really tell the difference. One is the length. Touring boats are designed to go from point A to point B efficiently. Whitewater boats are designed to spin. So you can sort of see the hull design is going to really determine what happens with the boat. A couple other things with our touring boat, so you can follow all the way down to the end, the stern, it's got a rudder. Helps when you've got wind and when the, when the boat is weather caulking to keep it going in a straight line. It also has hatches to stow gear and other bungees to help stow gear on your deck if you need it. So it's a great boat if, you, if your goal is to go some camping, take a look at wildlife, make some distance. These whitewater boats, like I said, they're designed to spin, so they don't go straight, so don't even try. They're designed to turn, maneuver, and work really fast. You can sort of think of all these boats, if the sea kayak is the minivan, this is sort of the Maserati. Turns fast. They're all boats, just like those are all cars, but they're designed for different purposes. So we're going to take some specific look at which boat is best for you. If you look at some of these whitewater boats, I'm going to pick this one up here. The hull, or the bottom of the boat, is a flat planing hull. You can see how flat it is. It's got a hard edge right here, okay? Hard chine. That's for doing more aerial maneuvers, designed to uh, surf really well, designed to turn really well. Our river runner here is also a flat planing hull boat, so it still has flat planing, planing hulls, but it's not as hard right here. It's designed for quick maneuvers with some speed. Our creek boat has got a displacement hull. So if you look at the hull, it's a little bit more round on the bottom. So it's designed to keep some hull speed, and it also has a lot of volume up near the front. So when you are going over waterfalls, this front kind of basically takes up the impact of the drop, and you're able to rise back up to the surface. So all these boats have different purposes. You should decide which, which one you'd like.